we are in radio contact with the graph. We hear that after a good rest, Ekener has come out of his cabin to fly the airship over New York. The old man is back in front. After sending my last dispatches to the newsroom, I get an enthusiastic message back from Hearst. You better prepare yourself, girl, for a splendid reception in New York. Gosh. What a glorious moment. The airship salutes our Statue of Liberty. We have all gathered in the wheelhouse. It's a breathtaking and solemn moment. We are silent and moved. Yes, people, 5,000 men, women, and children are sitting on newspapers in the park. The streets are packed. All available parking places have been taken. Deafening cheers rise up when the Zeppelin appears on the horizon. But when the airship flies over, the thousands standing to watch are silent. Drivers are breaking all the rules putting the brakes on and climbing onto the roofs of their automobiles. The police are trying to keep everything under control. They issue warnings and blow their whistles, but no one pays any attention. Pretty soon, the officers give up, shrug their shoulders, and turn their eyes up to the sky to join the watchers. Yes, people, New York has gone crazy. Here we are, right at the official stand. Within a few moments, the Graf Zeppelin will be back home. Leeds, Wilkins, and Lehman are the first to disembark. They are given a hero's welcome.
Here we are now in front of City Hall, waiting for the parade to start, and millions of people are waiting. <laughs> 